plan out my 20k IQ 20,000 IQ um, video and I think like because there's not gonna be like a video that's worth there's not gonna be a Among Us game that's worth the title of 20,000 IQ there's no plays in Among Us that I can pull off where I can say this play was so good it's 20,000 IQ So I think uh, what I'll do is more of a, a look back on the Among Us journey because I would say this is probably my last Among Us video for a while. So it's gonna, it's like a recap, like maybe of strategy, maybe of people, maybe of um, like how I got into Among Us. Because I feel like there, I feel like a lot has happened since Among Us started. And Among Us only started, what, eight, eight months ago, right? Eight months ago. Right, let's look at the very first uh, Among Us video. Among Us? The very first Among Us video. Tell me something good. Ah, <sighs> good enough for me. Oh yeah, the original catchphrase. This guy's toast. Jesus Christ! You can see the point where my editor realized a certain kind of thumbnail style worked better. <laughs> it also is coincidentally the time that the viewership went back to hitting a mill. Well, not these, but you know, like boom, went mill, 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 mill. Okay, when was the first video? This one. Oh, Ray was in the thumbnail? Maybe that's why it popped off. Gotta watch my own video's ads. August 8th, 2020. August 8th. So one, one thing that I get a little cheesed by. You guys know how I like to be my own hype man, right? And like talk myself up. I don't usually do it. I, I do it when it feels like people are forgetting or writing me off. It annoys me sometimes when people say like I hopped on the Among Us train when I was the train conductor getting the train to leave the station. You know, that was very insulting to me. Now, that doesn't mean I'm going around telling people, hey, I made Among Us popular, because that's not classy. But when someone called me a trend hopper for hopping on the Among Us trend, that's not, that's, that, that bothers me a bit. And also, when they say, like, I hopped on the IQ naming trend, it's like, no, no. Here's the thing. It became the meta because I made it the meta. I didn't do it because it was meta. It's something I did and it proved so effective that other people started doing it. Okay. Sorry, I just need to brag a little bit. Not because I want to, but because I need the world to know 
that I'm the best Among Us player in the world. Uh, can you see Steam trends? Steam player history? Is that it? Steam charts, Steam DB. Among Us. Steam charts. Jesus, what happened to this game? Okay. Listen, listen. Fuck. Started here, right? Oh my god, Among Us only had a thousand viewers at some point. So red is viewers, right? And blue is players. So I think red's a more interesting um, thing to look at as a, as a streamer. So on... Uh, oh, 23,000. July 2nd. July 2nd, 23,000. I think that was Soda, right? He played at 23. And then, oh man. Like, Soda p definitely put the game on the map. But oh, who was his mod that suggested it? Goes up to 43k. When when was the first time I played? Does anyone know? Like this is my first highlight video, but I feel like I've been playing the game for a few. Toast, you can just check your buy date. Oh, oh yeah, that's true. Uh, wait, where do you see that? I see play date. I see play time, last played. Oh, view purchase history. Jesus. Let me go back to August 1st Among Us. That's when we first played, right? Where's my blip here? Okay, so up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. And then August 1st is when we started playing. So people were playing Among Us for about a month before um, I tried it, right? Okay, now let's start. Let's let's zoom in on that time frame. So July first, first played, played for a month, and then August first, this guy's toe starts playing with his homies. Boom. Holy wait, it hit seven hundred thousand viewers. I'm very curious if any of these like big spikes are like big lobbies we had. Was this the was this the AOC lobby? September twenty seventh. And here we are, chat. Here, look, guys. I hate to say it, but you know, there's a certain trend going on. Ooh, 
Look, the trend speaks for itself. Like, we are streamers, right? We we play games that people want to watch. This it's just the circle of life when it comes to games. That was the PewDiePie game. That was. And there's a lot of spikes here. There's a spike twenty seventh, and the spike on October twelfth, twenty first. I'm very curious what these four spikes are. I know this spike. This is the release of airship. But what are these four spikes? Curious. AOC was October 20th ish. No, oh, that would explain this one, 21st. So this is the AOC. The both AOC lobbies? The second one was really off. Because AOC was super chill in the second one. But um, the other politician that was on, I think he thought it was more of a political outreach thing. With a bit of gaming versus a, a gaming thing with a bit of political stuff. Which was what the original AOC lobby felt like. The second lobby, I remember because you know, in Among Us, if you sit in like the spaceship lobby for too long, it kicks you out. Um, I think there was a moment where we got kicked out three times in a row because we didn't start the lobby because they were talking about politics. It was. It was a lot. It was a lot of politics. I'll be honest. I'm not a big political person. So, uh, the, so the first spike was the PewDiePie one, right? Oh, I was nervous. I was nervous because it was like PewDiePie, Jack Septic guy, Moist Critical. Oh wow, these are all big names, and here I am, little toasty boy. <laughs> 